go. I owe you one. Sorry I'm late. I ran into some unexpected trouble. All right, here goes. Back me up, would you? I'm gonna make pancakes. Think you can help? I guess you could say I've got a craving. I used to eat them all the time at the orphanage. I know they sell frozen ones nowadays, but nothing beats freshly cooked, right? You think so? I just thought more would be better than less. Well, let's go on and get started. Okay, uh, first things first. Uh, what exactly do we do first? Uh, I, I think the recipe said to use lots of butter and to regulate the pan's temperature with a damp washcloth. Wait, we put a washcloth in the pan? Won't it burn? You sure? <laughs> Thanks. I don't know how to cook anything besides the stuff I use for bodybuilding. I can break the eggs and mix the batter. I'll leave the actual cooking part to you. Oh, so that's how you use the washcloth. How about we add some protein powder? Hey, don't look at me like that. Oh, <laughs> I'd better go get the plates. All right, I think this will be enough. Oh, check it out! Wow, look at all the pancakes! I knew something smelled good! Yeah, just give me a minute. We can eat once I bring them out. Would you mind getting everyone else? And don't forget Amada. Okay! Oh, it's like a Tartarus of pancakes! Did the two of you make all of these yourselves? Yeah, although this guy was the one who cooked them. I said I had a hankering, but we might have made too much. I like pancakes, but no way I can eat all of these myself. If you guys could pitch in, that'd be great. So you like pancakes too, Sonata-san? Thank you. I can't wait to have some. I'll make some tea. I've got some leaves that'd be great for the occasion. It's pancake party time, as they say. What? Thanks for the pancakes. They were really good. Tasted like a lot of care went into them. If you ever make some again, I'd like to help out too. For as many as we made, they sure did disappear fast. Cooking's not really one of my strong points. A certain someone would always say, if you pour protein powder on the ingredients, then you shouldn't be in the kitchen, dumbass. Most of the time, I only ever got to watch someone else cook, so I never really learned myself. Anyways, thanks for helping out today. I'm hoping that cheered everyone up a little. They did things like this back when I was at the orphanage. I just wanted to recreate it. My sister used to cry all the time there. But the pancakes always brought a smile to her face. Hmm. Do you remember that medal you found in the package for my parents? My sister, Miki. She made that back when we were at the orphanage. Based on the letter that came with it, I guess my parents found it when they were cleaning. Miki was gonna give that to me after we learned I was getting adopted out and leaving. But then that fire happened right after. And this metal was all that was left of her. Apparently, Miki used to always say she wanted to thank me for being so strong and kind. She was really quiet, and she'd always be following me around. I don't really remember doing anything special for her, but I guess she was relying on me as her older brother. Seeing that metal made me think, would my sister be proud of who I am now? Am I really strong and kind enough to deserve that medal? If I'm being honest, I don't really know what it means to be strong or kind. 
Everyone who's ever said that to me has left without telling me the most important part. You saw how I was today. This is all I'm capable of right now. I haven't grown at all since I was a kid. <laughs> They'd laugh if they saw me now. <laughs> I'm glad you feel that way, but I've still got a long way to go. I realized I'd just been running away all this time, making excuses about having my own problems. But from now on, I'm gonna protect it all. We promised we'd become strong together. I won't let him down. Well, if that's how you feel, then I better not disappoint. <laughs> the point of this whole thing was to cheer everyone up. And yet I'm the one getting supported here, you know? I think you're the kind of person my sister would have looked up to. All right, that's enough talking about the past. Let's hurry up and finish clean. <clears throat> well, <clears throat> I ran into that group of punks on my way home from shopping today. There were even more from this time. And one guy managed to get a good hit in. Don't worry, though. I didn't do anything that would get me in trouble with the police. I just let them throw as many punches as they wanted until they got tired and gave up. I thought I could dodge them all, but uh, <laughs> I guess I've still got room to improve.